Hello, 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 and welcome to another Mantic Monday. Uh, we had a week off last week. It was, it was lovely. bank holiday. It's a national holiday here in the UK. So I imagine you spent all evening at home weeping about the lack of a Mantic Monday. But we're back tonight in spectacular style with a game of Vanguard. It's been a while since we played Vanguard on the stream. Uh, but there's a very special reason for that. Today's the day, the big day, that the Goblins have finally gone live on the Mantic website. So they're up for pre-order now. Uh, and to celebrate, we're going to have a quick game of Goblins versus Force of Nature. So it's me, Rob, uh, with my Goblins, of course, versus Elvis. With my Forces of Nature. Yeah, so first time you've taken the Force of Nature out for spin, I believe. Yes, mostly because I only started painting them yesterday afternoon. Okay, <laughs> I'm sure it'll be fine. So the Forces of Nature came out last month, at the end. Yes. Uh, and then we've got the Goblins. So we are playing my absolute favourite scenario, which is... Uh, secure the portal. It's the best scenario. It's the best scenario. I was playing this scenario at Border Conflict at the weekend. Shout out to Sharrod for a great event for that one. Uh, and that went particularly badly because my first turn, I think I had two guys get sucked into the portal, <laughs> um, including my commander. So that was that was a good start. Yeah. So uh, the, 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 the portal, as usual, was the most valuable player there. They're always in the Yeah, so uh, we're going to be playing this one. We've got 200 points. So, uh, do you want to run through your list quickly first, Elvis? Quickly. So, over this side. Oh, 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 oh. oh yeah, I see you doing that. So, I've got a uh, fire elemental, I have a druid, I have a wild companion, I have a centaur chief as my command model, and then I've got five salamander unblooded. Okay. Uh, so, let's run through my map. Okay, so I've obviously got some goblins, and I've got some of the new ones actually. Ooh. No, they're going to be brilliant. So I've got first of all, I've got a big git, who um, is actually going to be dropping slightly in points, which is nice. He's gone to thirty-two points, but it's yeah. not all good because he has lost a white dice. So he's got two red dice now. Uh, I've given him some equipment. I've given him a heavy weapon and a bow as well. Oh. Uh, then I've got the Stingit. Now he's a new command model for the goblins, and he's a very sneaky kind of ninja goblin. So he's going to be sneaking around, hopefully causing some havoc, because he has got scout and he's managed to make it all the way no. onto your, your deployment area up here. Yeah, now, right. now you can point. Yeah, yeah. 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 He's he's back there. Uh, now the Stingit, I've given the longbow, of course, cool. uh, which means he's got a 15 inch ranged attack. Quite tasty. Uh, and also given the elixir of resilience, my eyes were open to this at the weekend. <laughs> and hopefully we'll come to that later on. I won't tell you what that does, Elvis. That's going to be a surprise. <laughs> uh, I've got a troll. So this is my uh, nor and my snow troll that's defected to the goblins. Again, uh, Barry. Let's <laughs> Barry the troll. Uh, I've given Barry the potion of haste, uh, which is a good one for later on. That'll be a fun one for you as well, Elvis. And also a lucky charm. Lucky yeah, uh, I then got three rabble, so they're dotted around all over. It's got a rabble here, and then a couple of rabble with spears at the back. Uh, I've got a whiz, of course. Uh, my bladder nowadays, I do have to kind of whiz. <laughs> if it's a long stream, so I'll have to pop out. Uh, giving the whiz a lucky charm. Then I've got a look it or a look it. This is another one of the new models, which is down here, armed with his great big sword. I'll go see that later on. Uh, and then finally, I've got three spitters. So one, no, I've got two spitters. So three, one, two, there. Uh, so yeah, so there we go. So that's my list. Cool. So I guess we should. So I, uh, I actually, you finish setting up first. I did. So we'll roll to see who goes first. So it's plus one for you. You got a six. Six, and I've got a seven. So we roll again. Mm -hmm. I had to think then. <laughs> Maths. Uh, Four. So that's five, and I got five. Wow, this is. Right, so we just keep going. This, keep, this is the whole game. Four. Four. So five. Seven. So go right, on. there we go. Finally, right, I will go first. Awesome. Well, good. Good look, Elvis. Come on, let's roll. Hey, on camera. Oh, we've got that on the two. It just feels bad shaking the hand of a goblin player. How do you? So roll for power. How much power are you generating? You so turn? I get three normal. Yeah. Uh, I get one red for my fire elemental, one red for my druid, and one white for my symbol chief. Well, that's the same as me. So I get three red as normal, uh, two for the big git, one for the whiz, and one white for the sting git. Okay, not 
Everyone? So what did you roll? So, I only missed with one, so one, two, three, four, five. And you can re-roll oh, the other one. I re-rolled oh, you rolled, you rolled it. Okay, fair enough. So, oh, that's good. So I've got uh, five, six, seven, eight, and then I've got, I'll re-roll white. Ten. Quite nice. Yeah, lovely. Good. <laughs> Great. <laughs> uh, right, so let's crack on. Okay. Well, I think my first thing is going to, let's test out this Stingit, who's the new one. Ooh. So obviously he snuck back here, and with the longbow, he should be in range of your fire elemental. So let's just check this. So 15, oh, no, he's not quite, oh, he is, 15 inches. Nah, that's just that. That's not. <laughs> Get with it. Right, so 15 inches. So let's look at this guy. So the Stingit, he has a ranged attack of 3d8. Woo! And I'm going to pop in another one. Hits on eight, some yeah. support. And he hits on fours. What? He, hey, he spent a lot of time at ninja school training. He's got no piercing though. Not unless I do something else. Um, so he's got inspiring, scout, sneaky, and stealthy. So he's going to be hard to hit as well. Here we go. So needing fours. I got, oh, this is good. So you can verify this, Matt. I got two eights I and a six. So re roll for the eights. And I got a seven and a three, because that's four hits, Ooh. no piercing there. What are you saving on Elvis? Uh, fours. Ugh, so you've saved everything. See, the problem was you shot arrows made of wood at a fire. Yeah, right? I guess that's a very good point, actually. Yeah. Kind of uh, then, how far is your fire elemental able to go? Five. Five. What I'll do is I'm just going to. Gonna back up slightly just to make sure he can't get to me. You keep you keep telling yourself. Man. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> right. Over to you, then Elvis. Awesome. So I'm gonna spend a power to give uh, everyone in my warband uh, stride uh, pathfinder. So it's the oh. forest dweller special. Warband. Right. So that means you can charge to un yep. terrain as if it's about normal. Yeah. Okay. I suppose I've forgotten the main thing here is actually to run up to the, yeah, the uh, to the portal. Yeah, I've kind of got distracted there by <laughs> wanting to shoot something. Did you forget the portal? I forgot the portal. <laughs> so it's the druid charge running up there. Yep. And then... Just stay there. Just stay there. Yeah, stay there. Most okay. of her casty things apart from uh, heal or uh, long actions. Right. So I think she's going to stay there for a little bit. Okay, so over to me, unless you want to activate anyone else. Yep. Right, so I'm going to run around with my one of my rabble. Rabble, so rabble, rabble. I'm just going to run around to the other side of that tree. Let's stand at the bottom of the hill. Tree! There we go, ready. This is from tree. Yeah, actually, uh, no, no, I'll do. Yeah, I'm standing there. I don't think I'll be able to make it to the portal with him this time. Oh, that's a shame. Okay. Over to you, Elvis. How many models have you got, by the way? Uh, one, two, three, four, uh, nine. Okay. No, don't come to get my <laughs> sting it. <laughs> what are you talking about? You know. Oh, you can shoot, can't you? I forgot that. Can you shoot? <laughs> you got ranged attack. Yep. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I'm going to spend two power for Nature's Inferno. Okay. This is sound very good. Yeah, it sounds pretty good. And then three D8. Uh, hang on, I've got stealthy, so your it goes up by one. Your target. Uh, I always hit on a five, regardless of my five. Oh. Oh my, oh my goodness. <laughs> So, so you got one. one. <laughs> Any piercing? Uh, piercing one. That was what nature's in fair. Uh, piercing one. Okay. I, I really want to keep him alive, so I'm going to put an extra dice in. So two, piercing one. So I've got an armour of five. So I get it to six. Ooh. Oh, it's fine. I've got an eight and a one. <laughs> so that's pretty close there for the... Yes. Yeah, worth a shot. <laughs> yeah. Oh, is that a long action or a... Is that a range? It's a range attack, so... Okay. Yeah, so I could shoot you again, actually. 
I might do. Well, that's it. I might shoot you with my other spin. And I could shoot you again. Well, I could, well, I could shoot you again. It's just going to be two people shooting <laughs> yeah, again yeah. for the entire game. Yeah. <laughs> right, so this spitter here is going to pop off and hide behind that tent. Oh, actually, no, I don't need to. I don't hide behind the tent. I can get a clear shot on you, actually. You know, these tents are incredibly flammable. I know tents are flammable, yeah. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I've, I've, I've been camping before. <laughs> 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 Some experience. Yeah, well, actually, I was at, yeah, I was camping once when someone set fire to their tent uh, with a barbecue. That's a, that's a, that's a different story. <laughs> uh, it's a different story. From yeah. Time. Okay, so I'm gonna have a pop at your uh, fire elemental. So that is a clear shot, I'd say, uh, with the spitter. Uh, so the spitter has two d8. Yep. It's hitting on sixes. It's not particularly good. I get one extra for a clear shot. It's early in the game, but I might as well put an extra dice in. So here we go. So it's this spitter here. Yep. Shooting on the fire and elemental over there. So needing sixes. Well, so I've got, ooh, so an eight and a seven. Ooh. And a five. So two hits, no piercing on that one. Oh, he's fine. Oh, I'm a bit worried about this fire. What did you roll? Eight what? and a seven. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> um, Definitely. I will go on. No, I won't do anything else. Okay, cool. How much power have you got left? Two. Okay. That's because it's quite expensive, then, isn't it? Your two power. Oh, look at these guys, they're all legging it up towards the. So, is that a run? So, run. Okay. Um, oh, we're using the fancy acrylic one. Oh, yeah. Right, I'm going to get my, let's get the big git up into action. The big git? The big git, yeah. So you can go <laughs> 10. So how far can these guys go? 10. Uh, to the normal movie's five. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's fine. Let's be 10. So let's, let's, let's be brave. Let's be, for a goblin, let's be brave. <laughs> so he's going to run up. Oh, over there. Big brave boy. Um, so he's run. I might fatigue him then. Um, yeah, to shoot your chap in the open there. So the reason why I'm shooting, just in case anyone questions that, because I have given him a bow. Okay. Um, so that is why. Everyone stop panicking. So actually, yeah, no, we'll do that. Okay, so... What? 75% for goblins? Yes! It's about time! 2d8. Well, it's 75% well, for the goblins, for 17 for the 40, <laughs> and then 8. Well, that's, four, that's, that's yeah. fine! Yeah, put, I'm on four. Okay, <laughs> so... Oh, that was fatigued as well, sorry. So he's fatigued as well. Activated, I'm fatigued. Oops. <laughs> there we go. Right, so 4d8, so pop, pop the next dice in. And he's hitting on fives. So here we go. So one. Oh, come off it. <laughs> Boom. What's he so, what are you defending on? Uh, fives. So he failed. But he's got two wins. So, so you got so. one hit. Okay, let's stay. I'll take that. Um, and then I'm actually going to pay to activate another model. I'm going to pay to activate my whiz. And it's time for some shenanigans. Oh no. <laughs> sh 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 shenanigans. Right. <laughs> He's going to pop round there. Pop around to the face. Goblin shenanigans. And I'm going to try and cast Slink on my uh, big kit there. So Slink, just in case, this is a, a goblin faction specific spell. Target a friendly goblin model with a, one, a minus one modifier on the roll. If a hit is scored, Instead of suffering a wound, the target model removes any activation counter on it and can be activated again later this round. So, uh, so I'm going to shoot him. So it is, will be a clear shot because obviously I can see him. And I am within, let me just check this here. Well, obviously I am within six inches. Yep. Yeah. Uh, but I do need a six. So let's have a go. So let me just check. Yeah, it's a range five plus. I need a six. Here we go. Uh, yes, I get an eight. So now he's just fatigued. Goblin cheese. Carvest over to you. Goblin cheese. 
That sounds like you want to. Yeah. <laughs> no one wants to eat cotton cheese. <laughs> Not unless the whiz activates it. Um, right. Got a lot of those guys, haven't you? Um, I'm going to pay you to activate another one. Okay. the kind of beauty of this mission it kind of forces you to get up and get amongst it we had that graveyard last time didn't we? Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Uh, right so the lug gifts can move five so i'm just going to run up i really want to see this one do some damage because he's such a brilliant <laughs> just brilliant model there you go Boom. uh then i will so who have i fatigued i've fatigued i'm going to pay to activate another one I'm going to activate my big git again. Ooh. So, because he's fatigued, mm -hmm. he can do one short action, mm -hmm. and that will be to shoot the same guy that I shot last time. If he's not activated, can you use short action to remove his fatigue and then. Okay. Yes, mm -hmm. so at the end of this, he'll. Uh, okay, just checking. So, at the end of this, he'll remove his okay. fatigue. He'll remove his fatigue <laughs> as normal. So, three dice. Should I put another one in? So three dice. Yeah, we'll put another one in. Why not? Let's try and get rid of one of those. Mountain, gremlin games. There's goblins. Best of luck, cousins. Yes. Aww. See. Goblins <laughs> and gremlins are very closely related, <laughs> if you know your genealogy. <laughs> uh, right, so needing... Love it. <laughs> fives. That's three hits with no piercing. So that was against your one that's already wounded here. Yeah, he's dead. He's dead. Oh, grunt. Okay. Goes down. Uh, so he's, so he's grunt. No, yeah. he's dead. First blood to the goblins. Woo! <laughs> do, 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 do. Boo! Um, so that means he is now. So I take the fatigue counter off because the fatigue counter comes off at the end of the turn, and then he is marked as activated instead. Wow. Boo! Over to you, Elvis. Boo! Well. Yeah, stop booing. Boo. Right. Boo. Uh, <laughs> so three. Who else have you got left to activate? You've got quite a few of you. I have got one salamander and my uh, centaur chief. Okay. So centaur this goblin chief. spitter is going to run up to there. Ooh, come on. And then have a pop at your. You're going to shoot. Oh, see, you can wrench. Yeah, it's fine. You'll shoot this one up here. It's not a clear shot. So it's two. Oh, oh that's Matt's false leg dropping off there. <laughs> um, so it's this uh, spitter here. We'll shoot your unbloody there. So 2d8 needing sixes. So a seven and a four. So one hit. One second. Oh, okay, she's so fine. You killed one. What more do you want? Yeah. <laughs> Okay, everyone's going for it. A lot of presents. <laughs> so who else have you got to activate now, Elvis? This guy. The centaur. Yep, I'm going to spend... Oh, oh, I see. So you, you know, he's, he's keen to get first go. Yeah. <laughs> gallop, 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 gallop. Okay, galloping. So the centaur's galloping over there. He's... he's He's galloped so fast he's overshot the portal. Yeah, yeah, yeah it happens. He could just, it's gonna spin around. It's gonna spin around. Right, so I am gonna, so you're done now, are you? No. Okay. I'm gonna force fatigue my whiz. And I'm gonna try and cast slink again on my big gift. So, 2d8, because it's a clear shot. Um, how much fatigue have we going on? I've got a lot of fatigue. Let's pop, pop, pop an extra dice in, why not? So three, dice, one. needing sixes, why not? Uh, no, oh no, uh, so you my lucky charm now? Yeah, why not? 
I'll use my lucky charm. Round, lucky charm. That would be lucky charm. Yes. Oh, I'm sorry. No, and it failed miserably. <laughs> right. Oh, no. Uh, so that's a shame. That is a shame. You can't quite... Oh, they still can reach it, actually. I didn't need to do that. <laughs> oh, the pace before it's fatiguing. Then he's going to be... That's quite risky, actually, because then you'll be uh, fatigued next time. <laughs> uh, okay, I went for fatiguing. Instead, my... Troll can go, oh, not quite, he can't quite reach you, that's a shame. Yeah, sure, shame. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, So instead, the t how far can these, they can uh, charge 10 inches, can't they? Yes, they can. Okay, a few of those charge there. I'm just going to move my troll up to there. Move the troll to there. Just down, hopefully with your charge range. He'll be joined by his little pal, these two spitters. The ones that poke him forward, yeah? Yep. Um, and then I think I am done. So I can't, I don't, I, I don't really want to, to fatigue him yet. Okay, so I'm done. So I'm going to clear the fatigue off my wisp. That's the only one that I've got fatigued this week. Nice. So no points. So a very low score. Normally it's a rush to get to the portal, and we've instead we've kind of what you're talking about. faffed about a bit there. What are you talking about? I'm closer to the portal than you are. Okay. Oh, let's, go. let's go squad. <laughs> so that'll be turn two. Uh, yes, I cleared my fatigue. Power. So roll for power. Well, that looks like quite a lot of power there, Elvis. <laughs> How much power you rolled? Two, four, six. Six, okay. Six power. I guess you have to be in base. Ooh, okay. okay. So I've only got four at the minute. Ooh. Not great. But I can re-roll two. Two. So two commanders. Two. Oh, Ooh. six. So we're both on six. So use our power wisely. Boo. With great power comes another legally less troublesome line. Yeah. <laughs> With great power comes great killability. I think you saved it. Yeah, great. Yeah. So you were about to ring me up. Totes. So I'm going to activate my druid. Right. And she is going to cast Barrier of Binds. Oh yeah, you druid found that tree. Oh! Ooh. So you get to, what, what does the spell do? You get to place... I get to place a uh, a one inch wide by six inch long uh, marker anyone within 12 of the caster on open ground clear of any models uh it's height 10 impassable and blocks line of sight oh oh cool. Cool. so that is it's very in, in the way of <laughs> <laughs> amazing spell for this yes <laughs> right that's a power play on her all right i like that boom <laughs> Yet somehow I'm on 6%. Yeah. Yeah, right, fair enough. You know, I'm going to open up my phone and vote for you. Good, uh, good. Uh, Someone's going to vote for me. Yeah. I was, I don't know. Otherwise it's gonna actually, obviously, your hedge there is uh, more like 7 inches. So, oh, uh, it's, it's just because it's, it's, fluff, it off the, it's fluffed up a little okay, bit. Okay, so unfluff it a bit. Up. Squish it in a bit. It's, it's, it's fluffed up a little yeah, bit. Yeah. Matt, Matt measured this beforehand. Okay. He, he, actually, uh, the terrain grape one is 6 inches. You want to go grab that? Let's, let's you, you technically are closer, otherwise I have to climb over. Okay, there. that's fine. That's right. I'll let you off. I'll let you off. It's fine. I'll let you off this one time, Elvis. Don't forget this ah, ever again. I make a power play yeah, and yeah. all you do is complain. It was okay. the one bit of cheese I brought. Okay, I'll go. Thank you. <laughs> okay. So I'm bringing it back at least yeah. in the portal. I'll, I'll vote as well. <laughs> no. What? I'm going to vote on Mantic Games as well. <laughs> Because I can. <laughs> okay, so it's my go after that disgusting move, Elvis. I thought <laughs> I thought you were above that sort of shenanigan. Could have been worse. Did you not say to me, oh, you know, you can take two... I know, I did say, twice. yeah, you could take two and potentially just block <laughs> off entirely. <laughs> That's a pretty good spell, man. Oh, right, okay. I'm going to activate this spitter here. Yep. He will take a shot at your commander. So technically if that doesn't dispel then I can do it again and put another one down. 
Um, if you read the rules, I think it goes when you cast. You can only have one in play at once. I think, or do you have to roll? I can only have uh, one such barrier. Actually. And do you roll to see if it disappears? Yes, you. Okay, it's a bit like smoke grenades in um, Do Dead. Do Dead. 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 Okay, so this spitter here is going to have a clear shot at your commander. So that is three dice. Make it count. Needing sixes. Barrowing <laughs> yeah, uh, yeah. Three, uh, three dice in the sixes. So, uh, oh, an eight and a seven. An eight, another eight. These aren't even his usual dice. And a two. So three dice, no piercing. What do you save on? Five. So you got three. <sighs> what? Uh, and I'm gonna move <laughs> round. Move round to. Booyah. <laughs> just behind that. <laughs> run away! Yeah, run basically, away. run away! <laughs> uh, right, and I'm going to Flee. pay to activate another model. Ooh. So, if I can. Let's have a look. It's going to be within nine inches. Just use my. Yep, yeah, I'm going to move my command around to here. And then let's see, nine would be nine inches. Uh, which means I can use, instead of using my big bow, I can then use my poison blades. So I'm going to spend a power. Uh, use this ability when this model makes a ranged attack with its throwing knives. This attack has the piercing um, one rule. So is that a clear, that will be a clear shot? Yeah. Yes, do you agree with that, Elvis? Yes, <laughs> good. So I get 3d8, 3d8 as standard. I get one extra for being a clear shot. And I think I'll just pop a little cheeky extra dice in there as well. So I am... I think he wants you there. Yeah, I'm hitting on fours. <laughs> hitting on fours for this one with my knives. Pew, pew, pew. <laughs> so he's going to throw the knives out. Thanks. So that is only two. Piercing one. Piercing one, yep. Yeah. Two wounds. Two wounds. Ooh. Okay. <laughs> Sounds like gremlin rhyming slam. Mm. Are you fluffing my head? <laughs> <laughs> um. <laughs> I mean, if you ask nicely. <laughs> Okay, so how far can your dude go, your horse guy? I don't want to tell you. Okay, I think you can go 14, can't it? Okay, just, just that then, just for this. Oh, sorry. There you go. Okay. Oh, I see, push him back. No, no, it wasn't. Okay, it's over to you, Elvis. <laughs> the best emotion. So, whoa, whoa, before you do that, I'm going to spend two power to do escape. <laughs> uh, which means that I basically, it's the same as my flea, my warband ability, but I can use if the model is already activated or fatigued. And I move directly away five inches from you. Off the board. Okay, I didn't move off the board. <laughs> right, okay, <laughs> <laughs> Which I'm hoping, oops, sorry, just cuts me. I think if I've measured correctly, I'm out of your charge range. So. Really? Oh, am I not? <laughs> no! Oh. Okay then. At least that's about Okay. I thought I was going to. Poor guy who's back yeah. against the, uh, the abyss. <laughs> Oh dear. Well, I think the sting gets about to get stung. <laughs> so what do you need, Elvis, for this? Uh, three plus. Okay. Two. It's two? Oh, I could, have I got any questions, Jen? Uh, he's got smash. Uh, no. That's if you do... That's if you do three, three hits. Okay. Oh, yeah. Uh, so I... So you got two, do you say? Mm -hmm. For three wounds, so I'm not going to die. Uh, I'm going to put an extra dice in because I don't really want him to die. It would be a bit bad. If, uh, so I've got I've put, I've spent a power for an extra dice in. Uh, and he has got armour 5+. plus. Any questions, Ben? No. 
Uh, okay, so we need in five. One. Oh, because I said one wound. So you've got one wound on him. I'll, t I'll take that. I was I was a bit worried about that one. <laughs> okay. So my go, is it? Maybe. That's really irritating that all my dudes are over here. And <laughs> they can't. <laughs> um, Which is doing wonders. <laughs> I'm going to pay. Oh, you're going to pay it though. Okay. I have to pay another model. Okay. But the good thing is at least you can't shoot me over that impassable that big hedge you put there. <laughs> oh you can't shoot me over. Uh okay. Right. Bit of landscaping. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not going well for the compliments at the minute. I don't feel like we've uh... accomplished anything. No, <laughs> well, just generally. Right, so he's gonna go this spitter here. We'll get five to there. One sec. Okay. Go. Cool. You're within six of here. Yes. Are you going to pop out? Oh, so this is. So what is this? This oh, is this. my lurker. Right. Or my wild companion. So what did your lurker do? It runs out and charges. Okay. So it doesn't get benefits for charging, but it gets to make a free hit against you. Okay. So it's on two d8s. Oh dear. And what's it hitting on? Uh, fives. You got an eight and and two two hits. So you've got to hide that unit at the start. Yeah, you've got to hide. And Matt will can confirm. I can confirm. Yeah, and that's the... <laughs> that was where I chose to put it. Right, so I need to survive here. Uh, uh, Rob, you didn't. But... So that is my spitter. He's got armour of six. Sam, you get to get two. Two. So seven and a three. No, he is dead. Oh. He's long yeah. gone. But I am now going to splat that cat. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Suicide cat. Yeah. <laughs> Just jumps out, eats a goblin. Yeah, <laughs> it's done for the day. Well, it's time for my luggit to actually do something. I'm quite excited about using my luggit. So it's gonna fluff it. <laughs> I'm not gonna fluff it. <laughs> Don't say these things. <laughs> luggit's gonna run in and whack the cat with his great big sword. So the luggit normally gets two d eight. Yeah, I get one extra for charging in. Um, so yeah, should be hopefully. Uh, he's also got Smash and Crushing Strength 1, so a little bit of a bonus there compared to the version in the rulebook. So again, so here we go, hitting on fives. You fluffed it! Yeah, I did fluff it, <laughs> brilliant. That's good. <laughs> what did you roll? I rolled three, one, two, three. <laughs> uh, I'm going to fatigue and hit you back. Okay. Oh. Can't go for it. This cat, he loves it. Has oh. he got one? Oh, I don't, I don't want my... <gasps> so you one. Two. What's he hitting on? Oh, that's oh, Okay, so two. So my look it is armor five plus. Oh, come on, don't die. <laughs> so I've saved one, so he's not dead. Ooh. I've saved them both. Ha <laughs> ha! <laughs> Take that! Cat. Take what? <laughs> yeah, well, whatever I, I tried to do. Uh, over to you, Elvis. Cool. Going for the portal. Oh, this isn't good. Uh, so I guess I'm, I'm going to spend enough power to make it up. Okay. Oh, no. So you're going to get two points at the minute, won't you, for those two? Mm -hmm. Hmm. Right. Well, I, I want to kill that cat. So, it's more I'm personal. Gonna, yeah, right? I'm going to charge in with this rabble into the side there. It's going to flop it. I am going to flop it, probably. <laughs> so, the, after last time, I thought I'd do it last time. So, I get 1d8, yep. I get one extra for a friend, yep. and one for charging in. Yep. Um, but, oh, I need five. Oh, fives again. Here we go. Come on, don't flop it this time, rabble. You can do it. So, I've got two. Ooh. No crushing strength there. So he's got armor of six plus. Ooh, come on, come on, cat. And I'm gonna throw another dice in to try and Oh, I can't believe you want to keep this cat alive. It's... <laughs> oh, oh what'd what? you get? Oh, it's alive, I don't believe it. Yes! <laughs> <laughs> I'm not, 
I'm resisting the temptation to put the troll in there. That would be <laughs> absolute madness. This cat is locking down in so many. <laughs> so yeah, this cat has currently got my <laughs> look it. And I'm gonna add another uh, the thing on the, uh, the cat. Ball, yeah, the cat. <laughs> Force of nature and I'm tied with the bottle. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay, over to you, Elvis. That's so disappointing. Oh, we don't bring him in. What's he oh. doing? Oh dear, so he's, that's in the rear as well. Oh yeah. Oh, oh dear. Oh my. So, <laughs> do two attacks normally, be charged, and he's got a mate. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, he's fatigued. No, he it's doesn't. It's non fatigued model. <laughs> And what are you hitting on? Uh, I like that one. Uh, I like that four. Well, fours are nice because I hit on fours. Oh, so. well, I thought. Yeah. Uh, and it also crushing strength one. So yeah, yeah. crushing strength one because you're hitting from behind. Uh, and they've got crushing strength. Oh, so it goes into crushing strength two. Uh, so I'm on eight. Oh Ooh. dear. For my rabble, let me just check that. Yeah, no, seven. So that's fine. I'm good. So two hits on sevens. Rabble, rabble. No, oh. wait. My I did get a three and a four, which adds up to seven. <laughs> yeah, that's it. Uh, okay, so which way will you face now? Do I get to... You okay. know that you can follow up, but you can't engage me. That's fine. You've got to stay an inch away. Oh, okay, so you, you can't go into class. No, you can't go into... You can't engage me. Oh, I don't know how that <laughs> Spin on the spot. Well... Just a little pirouette. <laughs> I mean, I could shoot you. Uh, and then I'm going to activate another model. Yeah, well... He's blocking my way. You <laughs> stuff <laughs> like a bouncer. Yeah. yeah. Your name's not on the list. You're not coming in. Right. You're four feet tall. You ain't getting it. So <laughs> yeah, they have, a, you have to be taller than this tight ten. It's like a theme park <laughs> to go to ride the portal. Yeah. <laughs> That's so. So I've got zap. My spell, my whiz. I wonder if my whiz can do something here. So let me just remind myself what zap does. Not like uh, Zap is range 12 inches, 3d8. Woo! Uh, boosted version, cast as a long action instead as a book, but the spell has piercing one. Well, I quite like that. And yeah, I've got a lovely clear shot on you there as well, Elvis. So I'm going to zap you. And I'm going to fluff it spectacularly again. So. <laughs> So I normally get. Um, I'm so deep into his head. I know. Yeah. <laughs> so I normally get three. I get one extra because it's a clear shot, needing uh, fives. That's never going to happen, is it? I hope it is. <laughs> <laughs> I really hope it is. So needing fives. Here we go. Oh yes, that's two eights and a six. Oh, I'm on a fried salamander tonight for my tea. Uh, that's another eight and a five. And that's a three. Yeah. So a bit of a lackluster ending there. But um, five hits, piercing one. Ooh. Yes, that's what it's all about. <laughs> oh, Elvis, no. Uh, nearly. Oh. So he, he is dead. So he oh. takes two wounds. He takes two wounds. But... Oh, well done, Wiz. Wow. Well, someone on your team had to do something. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> uh, your go, Elvis. Cool. Uh, I am uh, all out of activations. Oh, you're done, are you? Okay, so you'll be going first. Mm. Right, let's have a look. Four. Okay. You can force, you can force fatigue, fatigue. This guy. Yeah. To take a shot at this guy. Okay. Poor little spitter. He's done <laughs> nothing wrong. Uh, you in the open? You are in the open, oh, actually. He should be marked as fatigued. Two. Two? Uh, there is no air. B -b 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 uh, no, okay. Well, I think he's probably going to be. So two, he's saving on sixes. Oh! oh. oh. Eight and a six. <laughs> Don't make that noise, Matt. That was a good roll. I was just in disbelief. Oh, okay. Uh, right, so now it's me to do whatever I please. Oh, no, you're right. <laughs> I'm simply an observer. Right, right I'm going to come in and charge your salamander with my troll. Uh, because I can, obviously, I'm, well, first of all, I'm high up, and I can obviously you're high up as well. So everyone's high up. Everyone's high up. So I'm going to, because the, yeah, because the bush, the, the giant bush <laughs> is blocked there, but I'll still be able to see your base. So he comes around, he's going to fall off there. So Barry, come on, Barry, you can do this. 
Come on, Barry, you can stay on there. Sorry, no, if you can't, if you can't. Yeah, no, no, you can stay on there, it's fine. You're too drunk. Uh, <laughs> and then, so, Troll. Get your troll off my bush. He gets 5d8, and he gets one extra for charging in. I'm hitting on fives. So let's see how this goes. Fingers crossed. I'm going to flop it. No, no, no. Oh, oh, he's, he's dead. Down. He said, you knocked, you got up Elvis then to knock him over. <laughs> so look, come on, you can do this. You can totally do this. You can do this, Barry. Hang on, we get some dice to prop him up. There we go. Come on, there we go. Right, great. Right, so hitting on fives. I have loved it. No, I haven't. Yes, I have. Oh, uh, yes, you. <laughs> uh, he has got a lucky charm. I won't do that. So two, okay. two hits, and he's got crushing strength three. Because I've given. Oh no, yeah, I think he's got crushing strength two. Sorry. So uh, he's got pounded. What did you get? No, oh, that guy's gone. Ooh. Right. So I'm going to follow up. So I'm going to get three inches to follow up. Doesn't bring me to the fourth, unfortunately. Ooh. At least it gets me close. Oh jeez, flipping bush. Jeez, like a garden in the world. Yeah. <laughs> um, so that was good. So I've got one power left. Power. Um, you've used obviously you've said you're finished now, haven't you? So. Um, well done. so I shouldn't have done the challenge. I should. Well, no, I could. <laughs> so I can run. So that's my goblin I can go. It'll be seven inches tall. Six inches to there. This is super measurements here. Two inches to there, which is eight inches. And another two inches. And now I have to fatigue myself. But I could go and get to the portal. Now, seeing as that's what the game's about, <laughs> it feels like I should try and do that. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I think I'm gonna have to do that. Otherwise. You're going to start scoring, which worries me. So I'm going to run around bloop, 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 and fatigue myself to stand next to the portal and then immediately, obviously, get sucked in. Next <laughs> go. <laughs> yeah, so, so this will be an interesting turn to see who actually gets, uh, who survives the encounter yeah. with the portal. So he's fatigued. Uh, and I've also got these two guys as well. The troll's left his handwork behind. Oh, yes, yeah, well, no, they're just, they're just his mates. <laughs> uh, Drinking buddies. Yeah, yeah, they're just like, whoa. <laughs> so obviously I can't see your... I mean, cat. Nope. But, so I'm going <laughs> to... So one, uh, one of the goblins is going to come in. Oh, no, he's already got a friend, doesn't he? So, I'm going to try and get round. I'm going to sprint round to your rear. And I'm going to fatigue myself to whack you in the back. Ow! So, run round. Poor cat. Yeah. Rude. I just want to get rid of this cat. <laughs> he is, I've never been more annoyed by him. <laughs> <laughs> the audacity of him leaping out at me, followed up by then surviving an attack, has just annoyed me. Two attacks. Two attacks. Oh, Alright, two attacks. <laughs> <laughs> right. And then I'm obviously going to end up charging with him in a minute, aren't I? Because I'm going to fluff this one. Uh, so that is a rabble with a spear. That doesn't make any difference that I've got the spear. I probably actually should have put the spear back to my anyway. So I get um, one d8, and I get one extra for a friend. Yeah. But because I'm attacking from the rear, uh, I do explode. I don't personally explode, but my <laughs> dice explode on sevens and eights. What? Yeah. Just wrote this rubbish. Well, I got one eight, so that's good. So that's one hit. You're going down, cat. And I got four. So one hit. Mm. Take that, cat. What are you saving on? Yeah, what are you saving on, Elvis? Uh, so normally sixes, <laughs> it will be sevens because of the piercing one and I'm reared. Oh, yeah. Uh, so he takes a wig. How, how many wigs you got? Two. Two? Okay. Well, my other action then. I've totally just got, I've totally got sucked into attacking this cat. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so he's gonna come round. So he'll have to do the same thing and fatigue himself to attack the cat. 
I don't, uh, how good was the sacrificial cat? Yeah, the sacrificial cat. I don't even know why it annoys me so much, but <laughs> it's just like it came out of the bush and killed him. Um, <laughs> so that does mean I've got the swarm ability though on my rabble, so I will get extra dice as well. So swarm, when contributing to an outnumbering bonus for another mo for another model's melee attack, models of this roll grant two bonus dice. So I will get one for normal, and then I get an extra one for my mate contributing. And you don't get an extra one for that one as well, do you? It doesn't keep stacking. No. It does not, I think. No, you only get no, one. No, you only get one. Only get yeah, but he gets two because he's... Because he's... Yeah, because he's a nice guy. Because he's stupid. Because he's stupid. Uh, outnumber it. No, you're not knocked down. So, yeah, so here we go. This is it. Dead cat time. Hang on, fives. I've got to take out this cat. Oh, he's got support as well, so he's going to end up being down now, isn't he? What's his name? Okay, let's try, let's try and hit it first. Hitting on fives. So two hits. No cushion strength this time, though. What are you saving on Elvis? Sixes. So it takes a wound, guys. Takes a wound. Uh, he... Well, he's not. So what he's around, is that? So... Is it a support? Yeah. Okay, so he's, he's out. He's down and out at the minute. Yep. So take a nerve test. Five, what's his nerve? Five, but... So he's... No, he's fine then. So he's just... But he is knocked down. Mm -hmm. So he's knocked down... He's not dead on one wound. So next time, if I just go up and stab him, he's dead. <laughs> not that I am excited about that, but I want that cat dead. Um, okay, so I've activated all my guys. Yay. I'm going to spend my last power to remove the fatigue. From yeah, I'm going to spend my last power to remove the fatigue from my big git. Uh, that is this is this bit in the middle here with the cat is ridiculous. <laughs> Absolutely insane. That one comes off. It's the, it's the oh, two, actually, sorry, not two problem power sorry, not play. The, yeah, <laughs> it was the. Uh, I meant the put a hedge down and then make him run around. <laughs> Taste of this. Yeah, no, I don't. Oh, I made a mistake there. I've made a terrible mistake. You made a terrible. I have to made a terrible mistake. mistake. I've removed the fatigue off the wrong one. I wanted to remove it off the stingit. Never mind. The sting it will live to hopefully fight another day. Too late, my friend, too late. Right, so <coughs> let's tally up the scores. Yes. Yeah. Elvis scores one, two uh, for both of his salamanders there, and I score three, I believe. Yes, I score three BPs, but now Ooh. we have to roll to see if the portal sucks us in. Elvis, you want to start with your salamanders? This guy. So on a seven or an eight? This guy. Oh, there goes one. <laughs> <laughs> Now, see, the problem I had when I was playing at the weekend is I was playing Abyssals, and this portal very clearly says it goes back to the Abyss. So they were all like, whee, let's yeah. go home! <laughs> uh, right, so rolling for uh, the big git, please don't get a 7 or 8. 5, he's safe. Ooh. So, so, so it's 3 points to me, 2 points to Elvis. And the portal has one. Yeah, so the Elvis, <laughs> so, so far the portal's taken out one person, oh. one salamander. How many? One, two, three, four, five. Oh, no, fine. I was just checking if you were broken. Oh. I also get, because I am within three inches of the portal with my commander, I get an extra red dice, which I haven't brought in. Bear with me. Play some jazz music, Matt. <laughs> <laughs> what happens with your hedge? Ah, yes, true. Yeah, because there's, no, there's a chance of it. End of each round. Ooh, Ready? Ooh, yeah. Go on, man. Yeah, just in case you haven't played this now. Hedge stays! The hedge stays! Oh, you've run one of the hedge, have you? <laughs> oh, good, I'm glad that stayed. <laughs> uh, have you rolled for power? I have rolled power. Um, yeah, so just in case you're wondering why I'm getting an extra red dice. If you're within three inches of the portal, um, oh no, I'm, I'm making no. No, that's power. No, that's power stones. Oh, oh, I didn't need oh, it. Okay, so I'm, I'm totally making no. Yeah. <laughs> sorry, sorry about that. Cheating there we go. Voice. There we go. So it's a good job. Uh, well, right, so Elvis's druid is behind this tree, and we've got the commander all the way at the top of the yeah the board there. So I rocked my power. Oh, little melee. <laughs> oh, that's not very good. Uh, so. Five at the minute, then I get two rerolls. Oh, five. What do you get? 
five as well. Ooh. It's not a very high power game, is it? <laughs> That's an eye urine. Ah! Oh! <laughs> just, <rude>. just terrible. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yes, I may. I will win. Look at what win luster is for you. I think that blows. <laughs> you know, you've got to be so careful with this scenario. <laughs> uh, phrasing. So no, <laughs> no wounds exist. Range nine inches, three d eight. No wounds are caused. Instead, for each hit scored, the target model is pushed back three inches directly away from the caster, stopping only for impassable terrain. So that's your awful hedge. Yeah. Uh, or other models. Yeah, I don't want to do that. Uh, what about lightning bolt? Lightning bolt. Uh, oh, hang on, did you give yourself the hedge move though? Yes. How many spells have you got? Uh, one, two, three. Oh, so you took one off first. Uh, yeah. So, Lightning Bolt is. Uh, it's a long action, range 12 inches, 3d8, piercing one, marksman, boosted version, costs two power, as above, but the attack gains the area effect two inches uh, rule. So, am I within two? I think I might be actually. Let me just. Okay, yeah. so I'm going to spend two power. Yeah, and it's a long action. And I'm going to shoot this. Did it, did it hit everybody? Or did it just hit my guys? It's just your guys, surely. Uh, but the attack gains the area effect two inches, 2d8 special rule for this casting. Yeah. Okay. So does it tell me what it hits on, or is it done on my... Uh, it's on your... Range. It's on your range, yeah. Okay. Four plus. So I'm going <laughs> to... Four? <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> so uh, it's all models, but I, who did you hit? Uh, your little goblin. The big hit. Okay, I think it might hit one of your guys as well. Two inches. Yeah. Oh, you're, you're being very liberal with your measuring there, Elvis. Uh, go on, you measure it your side then. Uh, it's still out. It's two, that's two inches. Look at that, it's just done. Okay. But anyway, so you've got four hits, yeah? On yeah. the big hit. Um, with, any, oh, with piercing one, isn't it? Wasn't it? I think it was a basic one. Uh, yes, range, range 12, 3d8, piercing one. Okay, so saving on sixes. I'm gonna put an extra dice in. I don't really want my, <laughs> it's still in work up there. So sixes. Uh, oh, so I've got a seven and an eight, so that's two save, save and you've got four, yeah? Mm -hmm. So he's not dead. That's the main thing, Goblin Lovers. He's got two wounds. He's taken two wounds. Uh, and now you're saying that the troll gets hit, aren't you? So, two inches, 2d8. So you roll 2d8 to see if it hits again on your, let me just check, I think it's on your same target. Bear with me, sorry. So I'll check this one. I don't want to get this one wrong. Uh, roll for each model separately. Yeah, so you roll for your normal target, the 2d8, needing whatever your lady needs. No, oh, yes, that's a miss. And we say we're going to hit. Okay. <laughs> um, my go? Impossible to read. I can't. I can't. Okay, fine. Well. Yeah, right. Uh, over to me. Because internet. Uh, internet. <laughs> <laughs> and then I'm gonna pay to activate another one. Okay. How far can? Oh, okay. Ah. Right, you have the troll. Troll. Troll on fire elemental. Fire elemental action. Yeah. Do you see fire elemental hitting on? Uh, five plus. There you go. Mm -hmm. Hmm. Five plus. Um, put an extra dice in. Put an extra dice in. Okay. What do you need? What do you need? <laughs> five plus, doesn't it? Five plus. Oh yeah, five plus. Four. So you got four hits. Four hits. Four. Any crucial strength? No. Okay, so my troll is saving on fours. Come on, you can do this troll. Barbecue. Oh, so two. I'll save two. 
That's good. It's it's two wounds, but two wounds. Yeah, yeah. It's more horrible. <laughs> uh, so two wounds and two. If it wasn't defrost night before, it is now. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I will shall I fatigue myself to hit you? No, I won't fatigue myself to hit you. So my go. Yeah. Right. Um, I know I can. I can't actually do that. <laughs> I was going to char- I was going to charge into you, but I can't charge. I still get a bonus as for that. So my big git mm-hmm. will come off the portal and just attack you there. So mm-hmm. you're still in a different arc. Yeah. Um, so I'm not going to get any bonuses for charging. I will get a bonus for my pal being there. Yep. So my big git normally hits on three d eights. I'll get one extra for my friend. Yep. I'm going to pop an extra dice in. I'm hitting on fours. Um, and I've also got sneaky as well, so I will be exploding on sevens and eights. So here we go, needing fours. Ooh. Oh, that is awful. <laughs> I've got one uh, with crushing strength three. Takes a wound. Takes a wound. So that didn't really go as I was hoping, really, that. Um, <sighs> wow. I'm going to pay. No, I'm not going to do that. Over to you, Elvis. So you can come out. So you won't get a charge because you wouldn't be able to see me. There's a big old conga one. Yeah. Right and your attack, so that's your salamander on my big git. Nope. So you missed, just fluffed it. Uh, I will. <laughs> I'll fatigue myself to retaliate, actually. Uh, so two was on the I was on the big git, is it? Yeah. Oh, it's not on yours. Okay. So I'm going to attack. So I'm going to fatigue myself to uh, retaliate against your salamander. Yep. So I get three d three d eight needing fours. Oh, that's more like it. So seven eight six seven eight. Uh, oh no, it's not. So four hits with crushing strength two because I've given him a heavy weapon. So, uh, so I can now. You're not engaging me. I'm engaging you. So I can break away. To, to I think I get a follow up action after I retaliate. Pretty sure. Let me just check. So if I do that, I can follow. I can follow up by going onto the. Um, when are you broken? Uh, when am I? Oh, he will be broken now. Ooh, so I so can. <laughs> <laughs> it, and it's no longer engaged. No, I am engaged because I'm engaged. I'm engaging that model, so I'm engaged with that model, so I can't follow up. Which is a shame. So glad that my two guys are left and inspiring. No. <laughs> <laughs> so how many have you got? Oh, okay, so you've only got three. Oh, left. I've got four. Oh, four. Oh, the cat. Yeah. Oh, the cat. Oh, the cat <laughs> comes back. <laughs> I bet you're very happy, Rob. Uh, <laughs> In that case, I don't really want my Stingit to die. So let me have a look. I've got... I can try and attack him, I guess. 2d8. It's not too bad, I guess. 2d8. So if it's a, it's a long action for me to break away, I think it's an armor save. I don't really fancy me. Fancy. Actually, is your, is your guy cavalry? Uh, yes. Oh, okay, so that means he's... One ex is what's his target? Normally got melee three plus, maybe on two plus. Oh, um, like, sorry, no, it's just oh. cavalry. Uh, yeah, so the cavalry increases the uh, decreases what you need to, what you need to roll. Um, okay. um, my first time using cavalry, yeah. So he's got he's got he's got what two wounds, doesn't he? I'm gonna have a pop, I'm gonna have a pop, pop. Let's, let's do this. So I get two D eight. Yep. Uh, See so what he hasn't thought of is now my cat's going to get up. Yeah, I'm going to pop an extra dice in. All three of them on the wall. <laughs> uh, uh, oh, six plus though. Yeah, six plus. Here we go. Let the burning dice come out then. Oh, uh, two uh, sevens. Go. No piercing though. Uh, I don't really want to lose my guys. I'm going to throw another one in. <laughs> 
Oh. oh. What did you get? Two eights and a six. Oh, <laughs> <not sure. laughs> wow. Now I now I could use. No, I don't want to do that really. I'm about to say I've got something called um, agile feint, which is use this ability after a model has made a melee attack and after any retaliation, this model may make a free breakaway action. Okay. Um, so breakaway. Okay. So. I'm Wait, whoa, 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 let me just. Are oh, you going to retaliate? I get to retaliate. Okay, so you're going to retaliate first. All right. So let's see if I survive. I was going to remind you that you can retaliate. So, oh, so two. So two. So you could actually wipe me out here, Elvis. I've got three wounds. You got any questions, Jen? No. So I'm on armor five plus. I've got no lucky charm. Do I put an extra dice in? I think oh, I will. That's good lucky charms. Yeah. Okay, here we go. Needing fives. Oh, oh, one. So I've saved one. So he's down to. He's got three wounds now. He's just clinging on there. Clinging on to life. <laughs> right, well, I can't use my breakaway action now because you've just. vexed me. <laughs> I vexed you. Right, so they're locked in there. That's not looking good. So my go. Your go. Let's oh, take. No, focus is my go. Oh, that was it. You were telling it. Yeah, your go. Uh, <laughs> oh, damn! I was going to take out like. Cat! Um, <laughs> we try and stand my cat up. Uh, so you just stand it up. Mm -hmm. uh, he's fatigued, which you didn't clear off last time. Yep. So he just, just stand stands up. there. Yeah. He stands there meowing. Uh, on one wound left. La laughing. Stands there meowing. Laughing. Who's he taking back up? Uh, I think that's my downed one. Okay. Oh, yeah. There you go. Right, let's work out. So they're both fatigued. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to whack you with my luggage. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> So the Lugget is 2d8 uh, and he gets two for his buddies there because they've got a spear. Not a spear, they've got a swarm. So he's on 4d8. <laughs> oh, yeah. I really don't want to. So he needs fives. Go don't fluff, fluff this, please. He's fluffing. Oh, two. Two, Christian Trent, one. So what do you need Elvis to save? Uh, so normally on sixes, I'll get sevens. Sevens. Ooh. Oh. So he's Goes zero, down. zero, so he's down. So do the nerve test. If he passes the nerve test, no. he doesn't. So that cat, yes! <laughs> That's all I care about. Yeah, you don't even care if you win no, the scenario. No, the cat, <laughs> take that cat. There he goes. Sucked into the portal. No. <laughs> he no. flies <laughs> off. Uh, so now I can... Move around, I'll just move around, I'll just turn around. So, well done, Lugget. It. it killed a cat. Yeah. So, we'll just call the game now, then, Elvis. <laughs> You've done your goal. I've done the one thing I wanted to do <laughs> is kill <laughs> that cat. Yeah, uh, kill that damn cat. So, he's. Is he fatigued? Mm, well, you're back. No, you're. Oh, um, I guess not. Okay. So, in that case. Uh, I'm gonna activate. That's your go. I'm done. Are you done it? Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, so I'm gonna activate my spitter here. Uh, so I'm gonna be five inches. So he's just gonna come up behind the troll. Oh jeez, it's like this hill again. <laughs> there we go. That's it. Get, you can get in there. So activate it now. Which means he'll be able to grant a bonus dice with his spear because he's like leaning past and jabbing you, jabbing and then it. setting on fire. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> <laughs> it's not the best ta tactic. He's got a couple of marshmallows in the um, I like to make through the bush. <laughs> troll. So the troll I'm going to fight. So five d eight as normal for a melee attack. Uh, oh, actually, first of all, I need to see if he regenerates. So regenerating on six plus. I, I was, I've never yet managed to regenerate in this game. <laughs> and I've still yet to regenerate in this game. So, uh, and an extra dice for the spear there. So 68, and I'm hitting on fives. It's not, you know, average. Yeah, average. Ooh. Oh, wow. Ooh, that is bad. Mm. So two, uh, with crushing strength two. Oh, I didn't even go. Uh, oh, whoa, 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 there. I'm going to use my lucky charm. No. Yes. <laughs> lucky charm. 
Which was useless. Yeah, they have proved to be very, very <laughs> unlucky. Yeah, yeah. Very, very lucky. So what are you saving on Elvis? Ah, one save, one wound. So normally on a fours and you crush and jump two. Uh, question number two, yeah? Yeah, so save one, one wound. Okay. Mm-hmm. How many wounds you got? Three. Three? And you've got one wound left then? Mm-hmm. Okay. Um, so I've got my whiz next. Blip, 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 blip. So can I get the whiz round? Can you whiz round? Can I whiz round? Oh, I can't because I've put them in. My big dude's blocking. Mwah, mwah. I could get to here. Oh, whoa, whoa there. Whoa. Just, the the luggage had an accident, right. M- MVP the hedge. Yeah, uh, yeah. I can't charge cats and tatties for tea boy. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like um, the back of my <laughs> uh, So I think I want to do my whiz. Uh, it's a daily problem. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I will run my whiz up here. Five inches. Uh, and then I'm going to cast Slink on my Lugget. Yes. So normally it is 1d8, but it's a clear shot, so 2d8. Needing sixes though. Ugh, no. So two twos. Two two. Two two. Two two. Desmond two two. Um, I'm going to spend a power to force fatigue my troll. Mm-hmm. And I'm another swing at this fire elemental. I'm quite keen to get rid of it. Um, so 5d8 is normal. And one extra for my buddy here. So oh, you'll be force fatigue. Doesn't mean I can't. Let me do a short action with him next time. Ooh, which is great. Uh, Probably all he needs to do. Yeah, so let's have a look. So 5d8, hitting on fives. So, oh, I get, oh no, that's better. So I've got eight, seven, five. So it's one hit and a reroll. So I've knocked you down either way, so I've got pound. Six, so four hits with crushing strength. Ooh. Two. How many did you save? You saved one. So it takes three wounds. So I'll take it down to minus two for the nerve. So what's its nerve? Uh, four plus. Four plus. Its nerve is normally four plus. Yeah. Okay, so that'll be six. He's so he's Don't gone. Oh. He explodes <laughs> in flames. I put a big bucket of water, doused him, <laughs> and I'll turn my. Troll around there. But it's not really good because I've, I've left now. I've left the old um, troll a bit exposed. Um, I've only got this spitter left here. Now the ultimate indignity here would be to. Oh, can I see your? Oh, no, I can't. <laughs> I'm gonna. <laughs> this is probably a bit <laughs> mad. I'm going to try and take it. How many wounds do your centaur got left? Two. So I'm going to run around with my... This is... I think this is a bad decision. But anyway, never mind. <laughs> I'm going to run around and fatigue myself to hit your centaur at the back. It's a good plan, theoretically, this. So the spitter, 1d8, and I got one extra for a friend, hitting on sixes. These are all going to be eights. These are going to be eights. One is an eight. One is an eight. And a seven. Eight and a seven, which explodes. <laughs> uh, oh, no, it doesn't. Oh, it's really sad then. I thought it was sick. <laughs> so two hits with Christian Strength one. Uh, so he's down. Oh, oh the. <laughs> does uh, but he's fine. Oh. oh, so he's knocked down. Knocked okay, down. so he's knocked down, but he's not dead. He's just waiting to get the sting it to yes. stab him. Let's go. Um, oh, I can just activate this one here. So you can just do a short action. Uh, just come up and stand up there. We're not a 
particularly good scoring for the portal one there. We got a bit distracted by getting too fighty in now, Chris. <laughs> um, it, I blame the cat. Yeah, it's definitely the cat. Uh, so no points for portal points there. No points for portal points. No, no points. Um, I need to clear all my activations. So I've got no power left, so I can't clear any fatigue. So the troll will still be fatigued. And I'm sure he's about to get blasted in the face. Um, the big git will still be fatigued. And my the the guy that's still in work over here is also fatigued. So turn four. So what are the points at the minute? Uh, three two to the goblins. Three, two. Oh, and I'll get an extra. No, I won't get an extra. That's power stones. So you're you are broken now, unfortunately. Alice. Right. So hedge, hedge days. What Ooh. hedge? The hedge has been the star player. Yeah. The cat's been the star player. So is the portal. <laughs> so uh, Elvis is. You've lost more than half your guys now. So that means you're broken. So you won't be rolling that many. Oh, you will be rolling that many dice. It's just your commanders left. Yeah. yeah. So I lose one red dice because. Okay. Lost fire at that Put the druid behind the tree. I've got commander still, so yeah. Three, yeah. So four, five, is that? Four. Okay, so I've got six, eight, the two rerolls. Uh, oh, this is nice. Ten, eleven. Ooh. And it's you to go first, Elvis. Okay. So you don't have to take a nerve check for your centaur because he's engaged. Mm -hmm. So that's. So, what's, activate my druid. What's the nerve of the druid? Uh, um, four plus. Three. Three. Oh, oh dear. So, <laughs> but she is inspired. Oh, okay. She can do this. She can't do this. She's got an even worse roll. <laughs> so she'll run directly back to her deployment, deployment zone. It's actually a bit irritating, Elvis, because I was going to come and charge you. Irritate. How inconsiderate of you. Irritating for you. <laughs> yeah. Hmm. All right, I'll spend power to activate my guy. Um, so you can basically stand, stand up. Oh, man. I thought after that hedge, Elvis, it was game over. Yeah. The hedge was your, yeah, that was your uh, best move, actually, so far. Putting a big, <laughs> growing some plants. <laughs> You like the Alan Titchmarsh of Vanguard. <laughs> That's two gardeners well. Uh, is it? Yeah. <laughs> right, so I'm going to activate my... So let me think about this. If I break away, then you could get a hit on me and it should knock me down. Well, it says new ability for goblins. Once around, a goblo can declare themselves awesome and clear two. That sounds like a... That sounds perfect to me. I like the idea of that. <laughs> there is actually the Blaggett has a move that's quite similar to that, so. Um. <laughs> right, so the Stingit will have a little stabby stabby at your centaur. So, 2d8, <laughs> I've got a friend as well, and I'll put an extra dice in. So, hitting on sixes, so come on, you can do this Stingit. You can, you can do this. So one hit with an eight, and then, so one hit. No crushing strength though. Okay, spend a power. Yep. Yeah. Oh, he's safe. Um, Which one hit me, your guy? The, yes, the sting it. Fatigue myself. Always gonna fatigue, always gonna hit me back. There's two of you over there, isn't there? Uh, <laughs> what do you need to hit me? Uh, five. Two plus. What? Him. No, of course, yes. Oh, no. <laughs> yeah, that'd be three. So three hits. Oh, I'll pop an extra one in to save this. Oh, no, has this gone, has this backfired? I think this possibly is <laughs> backfired. Uh, so saving on five. Oh, come on. So I've saved two. Oh, dear. So one gets through. I've got no lucky... Charm on him. The one seems to be down. Um, however, however, 
Right, well, let's hang on. Let's be, uh, let's best one to check. Let's check if he makes his nerve check first. So I'm down to zero. I need to do a nerve check. I've got nerve five plus. Inspiring sneaks only, so I can't inspire myself. So I need a five. Come on, you can do this. Ooh. I can't do this. He's gone. <laughs> no. Hoofed it. Oh, he made a mistake there. I was about to use my elixir of resilience, which is use at any time when this model is not down automatically stand the model up facing any direction. Mm. Oh. So, because he took. Yeah, that is a shame. But he's dead. That is very sad, but you are fatigued now. So you say it's a shame. It is, no, it is a shame. <laughs> that is the word I'm looking for. Is it? it yes. Is it? <laughs> is it a shame? Um, is it though? So, let's have a look at this. How am I going to get rid of your centaur? Ask nicely. Okay, no. It's your go though. Oh, you, I'm done. Okay, you're done. <laughs> well, let's go get some. Uh, let's go get some points. Yeah, throw oh. everything into yeah, the portal. Yeah. <laughs> Eventually, it's gonna get a kill on um, you. On yeah. I'll tell you what, let's surround the portal, shall we? Let's get around it. <laughs> Puddling. Let's get around. So this one will go around. Uh, this one will go round. Um, to the Oops. Can the look it make it? Probably. Oh, yeah. So the look it's going to come. So they're all going to come round the portal. We'll have like a portal party. Portal party! Oh my goodness. <laughs> um, so we can do. So how far are you? So we're quite a long way. 18 inches. So I can't. Unfortunately, because my troll is fatigued. Uh, I can't I, even with my even with my potion of haste. I can't reach you. Oh, no. <laughs> That's a shame, isn't it? So use when this when this item is used, the model may run as a short action. Um, so I could d d run after you. <laughs> um, it seems a bit cruel. Boom, boom. Um, I could come and give my centre a hand there. No. Right, so yeah, I'm gonna come and chase you down. <laughs> so my troll will go six. Oh, wait a minute. I can do some, I might be able to do some shenanigans. So six inches to there. Oh, let me see if he regenerates. So remember, never regenerated in this game. <laughs> I've yet to regenerate yeah. in this game. <laughs> How many wins has that bloody thing got left? Uh, it's got three wounds left. Left? Yeah. So my guy... Oh, no, my, two, two, My two. guy has two, three wounds and your guy's got three, four. Yeah. Only four. <laughs> um, let's have a look. So the Wiz... I'm coming now. Can, it, can he join the portal party? I don't know if he can, actually. Uh, ten. We might be able to. Ten to there. And then... Fatigue himself to run around. Turned up. <laughs> so this is a real banging party up here. Wow. It's like a massive like disc like light show. <laughs> so everyone is fatigued up here though. That's the only issue, slight issue I've got. So fatigued, fatigued, <laughs> fatigued. Um, and then also fatigued. <laughs> now I think you're about to enjoy this, Elvis. <laughs> uh, one's fatigued. So, let me just check. Let me just check the rules before I do something. Because I think uh, qualifies for charge action. Yes. Okay. So I'm going to activate. Let me just check the measurements work out first here. Uh, so that's 12 inches? Yeah. Okay. Here we go then. So I'm going to force fatigue my 12. Uh, and then I'm going to use Potion of Haste, which means, uh, so I can obviously, because I can force fatigue and do a short action. So I'm going to use my Potion of Haste, which is sundry single use. When this item is used, the model may run as a short action and as the Pathfinder special rule until the end of the turn. So because I can run as a short action, I can run into your Druid, which qualifies as a charge. Oh my lord. And then I can give you a good old whack. No whizzing in the portal. No. Oh, who's whizzing in the portal? No, no, that's... <laughs> the, it, the portal turns a different colour. It turns yellow if you do that. 
Um, I'm sure the abyss are really lovely. So, 5d8. One, oh, I've run out of dice. One extra for charging. I'll put an extra dice in as well. Because obviously you fatigue me. <laughs> that was good that you enjoyed that move though, Elvis. I told you you'd enjoy it. Right, here we go. <laughs> so hitting on, so that's gone. Oh no, it's already been there. I hit on five, but so far my troll's been fairly terrible. That's the consolation prize. Oh no, I'm not yeah, actually. Yeah, 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 uh, but because it's in the rear, it's Christian Strength 3, and I've knocked you down. Because oh, it's a yeah. pound. Well, if she survives this. So, Christian Strength 3. So, 8. Yeah. No. So, no. So, how many wounds has she got? 3. So, she's down then. Oh. Well, no, she goes firing. Yeah, but she's down. Oh, she's knocked down. Okay. No. Oh, so she passed a nerve but didn't do anything else. Right. Uh, so I've got one activation left, which is my uh, little chap here. So you're knocked down. I'm not knocked down. You're not knocked down anymore. Oh, you're fatigued. No, you can't open kitchen guys in there. Okay, that's fine. <laughs> uh, so I've got one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, six. That's good. So I'm going to try and hit your centaur in the back. Okay. I'm going to put an extra dice in. So I've got one dice, two dice, needing sixes. Now last time he was he was my star player, this little goblin. Ooh, yeah, so nice. needing sixes. Uh, I haven't got a sneaky. In the rear, it'll be Christian one though, so that's good. So sixes, here we go. One eight and a one. Ooh. Two eights. <laughs> two eights, Christian strength one. Oh yes, yeah. I believe in you. <laughs> What do you need? Uh, what, your, what question is for you? One. So he's on sixes. You've got one. One. Okay. He's knocked down. He's down. Oh, he's got inspiring. He's got inspiring. That's his uh, nerve. Four, but with a minus one. Uh, no, you won't be minus one, because I just took you down to zero wounds. How many saves did you make? One. Uh, and I only got two through, so you're on zero wins, so you're knocked down, but you're still alive. Still alive. <laughs> Bless it. Um, so, end, uh, I've got nothing else to do, so I'm going to clear all my fatigue off. I'm going to clear my fatigue as well. <laughs> all the goblins around the pool. Yeah, all the goblins are living this now, they're obviously now. <laughs> Going to all get sucked into the portal. It's okay, you, you won't fail any rolls. No, I will. This is when I, uh, I get three. Let me just check. It's three for yeah, three for those guys as well. So secure the portal. Yeah. So three, four, five, six, nine points. Nine. Nine points for the gobos. Ready for their <laughs> portal party. <laughs> Or let's see how many get sucked in. Okay, that's all that gone. Right, so we start with. Let's start with a whiz. Alright. Let's. Shall I roll it? Can you see it if I roll it up here? Let's zoom. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so I roll here. Yeah. Okay. Right so the whiz is safe. The the um, rabble is safe. That's a six. The next rabble is safe. It's a four. Mm. The lug it. It's safe. It's a three. Yeah, the big git. It's safe. It's a one. <laughs> oh, they're here to stay at this party, Elvis. Oh, the <laughs> there is free lemonade. Elvis looks really good. There's good tunes. Elvis is pleased with that one. Yeah. So turn five, final turn. And roll for power. Wow. A lot of power. All of the power. All the power. <laughs> uh, oh, I've got quite a lot of power as well. So three, four, five, six, seven, and then white re-roll. Nine. Talking and, of this. Oh, and it's you to go first. 
Yeah. Uh, quick map. <laughs> uh, I am going to stand my guy up. Uh, yeah. And then he's going to take a swing at you because he's had a okay. fatigue. And I'm gonna turn around. I'm going to turn around. This is a bang. So there's the. So we're hitting on twos. So that's three. Three successes. Okay. No constraints on saving on sixes. Would it be amazing, Albus, if this goblin survives all the way to the end of the game? Albus. I said, wouldn't it be amazing? You're not answering me. Albus. I said, wouldn't <laughs> it be amazing? So here we go. Sixes. No. It didn't, in fact, I don't think, that, no, I've got two twos and a three. So he is, that poor spitter, who I thought was going to take you out. Is he only a grunt? He is only a grunt, yeah. Um, so I get to move. You can move three inches, yeah. I can to all the way over here. Okay. You going to activate anyone else? Uh, activate another mini to stand my girl up. Is she fatigued? Uh, she is, so she just stands up and just stands up. Um, and she comes back with one move and move. Uh, she's gonna turn around. Okay, I'm gonna activate my troll, predictably. Oh, what about your hedge? Oh, you can see. Oh, hedge. here we go. The most important the thing of the game. That stays. Oh, what does it wow. stay on? <laughs> yeah, it goes on a five plus. Oh, what? <laughs> Can't go with that hedge. It's obviously well, you've done a very good job of planting that head. <laughs> you've uh, got some moist compost. Uh, okay, troll time. Troll time. We generate first. Let's this see. is it, first time. Oh, on camera, I'm gonna roll it there. Mm -hmm. This is gonna be it, six plus. No, That's a four. So yet to regenerate in this game. <laughs> uh, and I'm gonna whack your uh, druid. So the, dru uh, the troll is on five dice. Uh, I'm going to spend a power to put an extra dice in. So six dice. Hang on, five. What is the insult now? The trolls are not really. He's whiffed a lot of his rolls. Come on. So fives. Oh, no. Oh, good. Finally. Finally. So, uh, oh, that was. F so I've got five hits. Ooh. Two sixes, two fives, and a seven. So you're knocked down. Well, let's see. Let's we'll see if you survive first. Let's just throw another dice in. It'll be fun. What do you need to survive, Elvis? Eight. Eight. You've got so no eights. So, found that many. So, <laughs> one, two, three, four, five, six dice. So, you need an eight, I think, to survive. Oh, what are you inspiring? No. Uh, Come on. Uh, oh, uh, you can do it. Oh, you can't do it. Oh, no. Oh, dear. So, the troll will turn around. He wants to look at the party, <laughs> where all his pals are. Hey, you guys, what's going on up on the hill? <laughs> Where's my party at? You've still got that mountain behind you. Yeah. Thanks, He's still, Matt. Matt still believes you can do it. Yeah. I can't. Um, well, <laughs> thanks. Um, That's all that matters, Elvis. Elvis, do you want to do anything else? No. <laughs> I mean... <laughs> I'm not, I mean, I could be a douche and try and hit you with my spells, but I don't think I'm going to, I mean, I could try and do that, couldn't I? Should we try and do that? Should we try and kill if, this? If, if you finish him off, I get to go home for dinner, so. Okay. Uh, yeah, all right, let's, let's do that then. So. This is why we don't let him on the street. Yeah. yeah. Well, I haven't been on, I haven't been on for a long time. So. <laughs> The, it's because it's Ben Edwards beat me a dread ball. I'm sad. So I yeah, you, haven't, you haven't been on stream before for a long time, except the last time we were yeah, on stream. Yeah, yeah, and I got really sad then because Matt, because uh, uh, he beat me. So the Wiz is going to try and cast a spell on this guy. So I'm going to use it as a long action. So 3d8, I'll put an extra dice in. So four, hitting on fives. So this is zap. I'm zapping you. Ooh. Actually, I'm going to spend another one to do cackle. Which means I can use when the model activates, this model may cast the same spell twice this turn. Ooh. So I can zap it twice. So here we go. Uh, oh, because I have to proceed myself to zap you as a short action. Anyway, yes. we'll come to that in a minute. So four dice needing fives. I've got ooh, an eight and a six, so the eight explodes. Three hits on crushing strength one. So what do you need to survive, Elvis? Crushing strength one. Yeah. Um, what did you send for? Uh, sixes. 
happens. You save one. So you save one. Fails his. Uh... Oh, hang on. So he's okay. So you right. And fails again. Cool. So the centaur is is dead. Oh, oh. no! <laughs> oh dear. Oh. And then the the goblins. Come on, let's get the tr- the troll comes back up. He wants to join in the party as well. Oh, guys, this is a great party. Um, it's obviously someone's birthday. That's the thing I failed to mention. It was uh, the wizard's birthday, so they really needed to get up to that portal ready for the party. So, uh, hopefully an impressive outing by the goblins there. Elvis, I thought you were a bit unlucky, even with your amazing hedge antics. Uh, that was a good time. I, I like that really messed me up to put the hedge there because then I had to faff around going round it for a while. Um, you know, like I said, if you'd had the two druids putting like one hedge here, you could have like, yeah, basically. <laughs> of course, you can't get three <laughs> druids in, otherwise, you can actually do this. Do that. <laughs> um, but yeah, I thought that was good. And I think the, that hedge tactic, you know, if you, you know, like things like blocking me in here actually would have been good as well because then. Yeah, but I can get over there. I know, but I'm just saying that's the kind of expert things you can do with the hedge. Um, so, I hope you enjoyed that everyone, I hope you enjoyed the goblins and force of nature in action, particularly uh, the goblins, uh, I thoroughly <laughs> enjoyed that performance by them. Um, yes, three so the goblins could win. Yeah, yeah, it's, it's so I can make web sales this month. Yeah, yeah, so yeah, we wanted to show the goblins at their best. Um, but yeah, make sure you are keep an eye on the blog this week as we're looking at all the different goblins. So today we had uh, a little bit of analysis of their... Uh, Warband ability and their spells. Jeez. Tomorrow we've got some key units. Um, and then later on in the week we're going to look at some of the new things as well, like the Stingit uh, and the Snagit and the Wingit. Uh, you can see a theme going on Love here it. and the Flagit. Um, yeah, so we're going to be doing all those this week and obviously they've gone up for pre order today. So thank you very much for tuning in thank you. and uh, we'll see you soon. Bye bye. Bye.